I'm thinking this one is gonna be legit Cause it's fuzzy brain And how I made it, yeah Well, hey everyone, we are back. I've missed you guys. Um, I've always been like skeptical when people are like, like YouTubers, are like, oh, I miss you. It's like you're talking to a camera. How can you miss someone? But I seriously miss doing this and like having this interaction with you guys. Um, so glad to be back. I hope everyone's doing well. Um, it's a rainy day here in Austin, Texas. Doesn't rain too often here. Um, but, anyways. Let's take a look at this file. Okay, I know I said Fairy Game was like my favorite song, but I think Fuzzy Brain is, I mean, considering it's the title track um, of the record, but I, I just love this song, and I think I took the most time, honestly, writing it and making sure it felt like something. Yeah, I guess we can start with guitars. There's actually a lot of guitar layers going on. Um, or no, actually, let's look at drums first, because drums are pretty funny. I There's just like an Apple loop called Analog Drum Machine 15. And that's that's the drum. Yeah, I just used that and layered it with the shaker that I recorded. Cool, so yeah, let's check out the guitars. We've got some acoustic guitars, pan left and right. We've got a 12 string. It comes in on the choruses um, that is behind me. And these three electric or four electric guitar takes. So we've got an open strum, kind of like hinting at the melody. There's like this plug guitar pan left and right. It goes on like the um, pre-chorus parts. Kind of like a palm mute style. Um, yeah, but that's the electric guitar. And a lot of people have been asking me to like go through like plugins and processing. And one thing I do have to say about that, um, for those of you who do care about engineering and are like looking for the next plugin to like make your music better, um, all of this is like Logic stock stuff for the most part, or free plugins that I found online. Um, so I'm definitely a believer in like learning how to use what you have rather than buying the next thing that might help you achieve a certain sound because um, you can get lost in a world of plugins and um, just spend a lot of money and that's not what music is about you know it's not about like having the most expensive stuff it's knowing how to use what you have there's tons of plugins I'd love to share um, if you're like really a plugin like like really, like I really do need a plugin because I'm 100% missing something. Um, then message me and we can talk about plugins um, if I see your message. Um, but yeah, as all all of this for the most part is just like Logic stuff or like free things that I found online. Um, I just use like these Logic amps, you know, British Combo Clean. That's a preset. Um, but it's just about having good source audio recording it well. and um, I use a Focusrite Scarlett uh, 18i20 preamp, so like the same as the little red box, just with more inputs, because I have all these synths and stuff now. Onto the acoustic guitars. So the acoustic guitars are pinned left and right. They play throughout the entire song. Um, Pretty simple stuff. I believe it's like 
Sorry, I'm gonna play it on my electric. On the seventh frets, and I just play C, E minor, F, C, E minor, F. Those like pre-chorus parts is a D minor into a G major seven, I think. Um, it's just like a G right here where your pinky would normally be underneath. It's just, you stay, your first finger stays on that, that D minor shape. Into a C, into a, uh, a minor. Rain outside, steady winter. My heart feels like such a mixture. Shapeless, I stare at a picture. E minor into an A major. D minor into G major 7, I think. Into a C. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's how you play Fuzzy Brain on the guitar. Definitely the most like folk influenced song. I loved Connor Oberst um, and like Bright Eyes and like that just whole world of music for a while. Um, I still do, but I feel like this song is really heavily um, like Bright Eyes influenced with a mix of like psychedelic synth stuff. Um, that was my goal with the song, so maybe it worked. I don't know. I've never heard my songs before. Um, I just make them. Yeah, I've never heard my songs like for the first time before. So, you guys have a much different experience with these songs than me. So, I'm jealous of you. I wonder what it's like to hear my music. Um, I'll never know. Anyways, um, the bass is very simple too. It's just. Just like open notes. following like the root, no like melodic stuff going on. Okay, on to the synths. We've got this drone, like Farthesis sound I believe, I have from Analog Lab. Um, I know it's a Vox. Cool. Literally that chord just goes through. The entire song. It's like this analog lab, which I believe is yes, a Farfisa home organ preset in analog lab. Just following the melody as well. Um, yeah. Yeah, and this is a pretty iconic, important part of Fuzzy Brain too, is this Mellotron sound. Um, I have, oh, it's actually just a Logic Mellotron. Um, it's just like a string sample mixed with the male choir sample playing those chords. Oh, I, I forgot to show you this 12 string. Yes, yeah, so this 12 string comes in with it. Kind of almost makes it feel like it's a sample from an old record or something. Yeah, I remember I had this song written on guitar for quite a while, and then once I put that Mellotron sound in, I was just like, okay, like I know what this song is now. It was a really good feeling, um, just trying that out. Because um, I believe that was my first take. Yeah, there's some little notes in there that was just like a freestyle thing, probably just crying, playing it. The second pre-chorus in, there's like this psychedelic warp sound that a lot of people ask about. It is an analog lab sound as well, running through like this tape sound. But I was messing around with it. 
end of a pitch uh, wheel is like just really crazy going up and so I was like that'd be cool if it just rose into the right note so it's just like the modulation um, rising into the note I love that. So for vocals, we're gonna check those out. Pretty much the same thing as all these other songs that we have, a pan all the way left, pan in the middle, uh, pan to the right. Uh, so it's like three takes, really with like a tape sound to this plug in I always shout out. Where do I begin? Just with that, uh, no, I don't understand it either. The like slap back feedback I don't delay think really I makes can. it kind of like the signature sound. Fuzzy brain, call it what you want. I felt so distant lately, as if I were not. I've got harmony coming in just a little bit to the right. There's a third part harmony. Um, in my head, there's rain inside my skeleton frame. A hurricane within my rib cage. I never left, but I never stayed. I'm cleaning out the fuzz in my brain. Time. Okay, well, all right. Well, that is Fuzzy Brain. Um, thanks for watching. You guys have just been troopers, just listening to me ramble um, and walk through these songs. Um, it's been tons of fun. We're getting closer to the end. Um, so, I guess I'm just thankful for you guys. Um, that sounds really cliche, and it's easy to be vague. Um, like as an artist, like thank you for like being a fan, but like I really want you guys to know that you're each like really appreciated. Um, although I don't know a lot of you personally, um, I want to someday, I'd love to um, be able to get to know you, um, but I just think it's so incredible and I feel so blessed that you guys like watch these and I can be a teacher because I definitely didn't think when I was making these songs like people would care um, to watch how I made them. Um, so thanks for thanks for watching. Um, if you have any questions, please ask. I'm sorry if I don't reply. I get a lot of messages. Um, not that I'm like a big deal, but I can't see all your messages um, all the time. But if you do have a serious question or anything about like mixing, I'll I'll try to answer it. Um, but anyways, I hope you're all staying safe. Um, I hope you're washing your hands. <laughs> um, just wash your hands, you know? Um, but 
yeah, thanks for watching. I already said that so many times, but thanks for watching. Um, I will see you guys next week. <laughs> oh, um, and... Okay, that was awesome.